So today we have word work one as the write the room. Actually, it's called read the room. You're going to be reading the words around the room that have Y as an I sound at the end, like is in sky, shy, fly. And then on the other side, we have words that have a Y at the end that sounds like a long E, like funny, handy, sunny. We've been working on those words, so those should be easy for you to either write them on the long I sign side or the long E sound. Remember that ma mystical, magical Y, sometimes it makes I or Y or E sound. All right, so then we have word work two, which is a sorting paid or sorting activity like we kind of like we did last week, but these are different words like the ink family, like sink, tank, bank. And then we have the ink family, like stink, think, drink. And then we have the unk family, like skunk, drunk, and other ones like that. So you have your picture cards. Hopefully the person before you will sort them up here at the top so therefore you can find your cards. And then you're going to find which word it is. And I don't have all my words spread out that really well, but if I were to just look at my words right now, I think this one might be, hmm, trunk, think, drink, link, crank, sink, blink. Ooh, blink, there it is. That's what that picture is showing. Then we have like words like tank and sank, a picture of a ship or a submarine that has sank, it's flipping over, and a tank with fish in it. And then we have some shoes that stink, and there's that word ink, stink family right there. After you're done sorting those, you need to take the pictures off so that next person can start all over and they can put their words with the pictures. And then we have in the drawer too is a puppy with really small words on it. And you have a little magnifying glass in the baggie that it needs to go in the baggie after every turn. You're gonna take out the little magnifying glass and you're going to read those words that you find. You're gonna write them on the line. It says, search for words that have the vowel signs of the Y. Remember the happy or fry, long I or long E sound at the end. Then when you're done writing those words on these lines, and when the timer goes off, then you put the magnifying glass back in the baggie. This little guy is going to get lost, so we got to take good care of him. Put him in the baggie, and then turn in your paper and put the, ma the magnifying glass back in the drawer for word work two. That way the next person can find the puppy with the magnifying glass if they need to. That's as if, if you finish writing those words or uh, sorting those words, then you get the puppy with the magnifying glass. You've got to do the words with the pictures first and then turn in your work. All right, writing. Here's the writing page right here, the bottom drawer. You can stand right here or right over here on the cabinet somewhere and get a clipboard if you want. Then a pencil. Oh, this one needs to be sharpened. Miss Moore's going to put it in the pink basket because some people are forgetting to put the sh pencils that need to be sharpened in the pink basket. Once you have your writing paper ready to go, you're going to be using these words right here in sentences. So we have puppy, fly, cry, and lucky. Puppy, fly, cry, lucky. So first word is puppy. We're going to write a sentence. And then fly, you're going to write a sentence. Cry, you're going to write a sentence. And lucky. It's your choice what you want to say with those sentences. Then put a period at the end. Make sure you have a capital letter, too, at the beginning. Seat work today looks like this. It's called spell the word. You'll be doing it at your seat. Here are the words that you're going to use. Dry, shy, candy, cry, fry, penny, happy, bunny, sky. And there's the pictures. You're going to match the word to the picture. This is seat work. I love to see your coloring whenever you're done matching those words to the pictures. It's even better when you make it colorful. All right, that's it.